Committee today, and I'm serving on the Revitalise 250 Giving Committee. I'm passionate about the Revitalise 250 project because it will enable us not just to grow our church, but also to do so much more in the community, for the vulnerable, and for those who need our support more than ever in these challenging times. Now, as a dad, I'm excited about what our fantastic children's and youth ministry team will be able to offer in the expanded facilities. As Jago has highlighted, Revitalist 250 is a substantial project and it will cost over four and a half million to realise our plans. Thus, in addition to us, the congregation, we are also approaching charitable foundations, including grant-making trusts and high net worth individuals for their support. However, this is our project. We know the church and what we can achieve best. So we must lead it. We are hoping that two thirds of the funding can be supported by the church family. It is important to note the potential trust and high net worth donors will be looking for evidence of financial support from us, the congregation, before committing themselves. If you would like to support the project, we would ask you to visit the Revitalize 250 giving page on the HTC website. You can find this in the giving drop down menu. If you are not ready to give now, but instead would like to pledge, please do so when you have made your decision because it really helps us plan. We are asking if you would indicate whether this would be through a one-off gift, monthly giving over a year, or monthly giving over four years, which is the course of the project. And remember, please do fill out the gift day declaration if you are a UK taxpayer. If you'd like to learn more on the Revitalized 250 project and our plans, there's a dedicated and detailed page on the site. The work that God began at HTC with William Woolforce and the Clapham sect is not finished. It is with your support that we can complete Revitalize 250 and continue the work that they began.